this video will teach you how to download and upload an STL file from the Tinkercad app to Google Classroom. When you're all finished with your design, it's nice and detailed and you're happy with where it's got. Like for me, I've got lots of holes. I have a hidden name tag on the back that's only cut in just a little bit to my design. And I have some parts that are sticking out and different elevation changes. I'm pretty happy with how this final product looks. First thing I have to do is rename my project. So I'm going to click on the name up here, Bodacious Kieran. And I'm going to rename it to my name and my class. And what color I would like the project. In my case, I would like red. But you can choose from red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple. Those colors will be on the Google Classroom description. When I'm ready to download this, I can click on the word export. And then I want to save this everything in the design. You do not want selected shapes. Tap STL. And it's going to prepare and download your STL file. Here you're going to click save to files. And you can choose a spot on your iPad. Inside my iPad, I'm actually going to make a new folder. I'm going to call this one 3D prints, just in case I want to save more. I'll tap on the folder I want to save it in and click save. And now I've saved this to my device. So now I can go to Google Classroom and find my assignment. Here I need to swipe up your work and I'm going to add an attachment. Here I can click a file. If I do not see my file here, I can actually see it top on the top left. I can click browse, go to locations and click on my iPad. There's my 3D prints folder and I can tap on the file. It's going to upload this to Google Classroom. When I'm all finished, I can mark as done. And that's it. I am all uploaded and ready to go.